Hello and welcome to Foxtech. In today's video, we'll be talking about a very handy feature available on iPhones with iOS 15 and later drag and drop functionality. It's a pretty easy process to learn and it won't take a lot of time. If you're not familiar with it yet, don't worry. I'll guide you through every step. First and foremost, iOS 15 introduced this drag and drop feature to iPhones, revolutionizing how we interact with our devices. If your iPhone isn't updated to iOS 15 or later, I highly recommend doing that now. However, I doubt many of you are using an older version than iOS 15. This feature significantly improves the user experience by making it easier to move various types of content between different apps. So what can you do with drag and drop? For starters, you can quickly move one or more photos from web browsers, image searches, or your camera roll to applications like messages or notes. It's straightforward. Hold down on the photo you want to move and it gets selected. Then you can drag it to another place, hence the name drag and drop. This feature is particularly useful for copying and pasting text. Instead of the traditional method of pressing copy and then paste, drag and drop makes the process more intuitive. You can highlight the text from various sources, including live text captured by your camera, and simply drag it to the desired app. Moreover, the drag and drop functionality isn't limited to just photos and text. You can move files between different apps seamlessly. This makes organizing your documents and media much simpler. Ensure that your device is always updated to the latest version of iOS as new features and enhancements are constantly being added, further improving drag and drop capabilities. With iOS 17, Live Text takes this functionality even further. You can now copy text from photos and drag it to other applications. This is incredibly useful for saving information from images without the need to type it out manually. It's another way Apple has streamlined the user experience with this feature. Additionally, you can drag and drop files from iCloud to other apps. This means your cloud stored files are easily accessible and can be moved to different locations with just a few taps and drags. It's a great way to manage your files and keep everything organized across various applications on your iPhone. Thank you for watching this tutorial on how to drag and drop files on your iPhone. I hope you found it helpful and easy to follow. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing to Fox Tech for more tech tips and tutorials. Until next time, peace.